waking up, doing some skincare, and ice rolling my face. I'm going to be recreating Hailey Bieber's Air One smoothie. And I'm super excited about this because there's no Air Ones in New York. And I'm so intrigued by it. I was on like Air One TikTok for like a long time. And I'm so intrigued by this super bougie supermarket. So I really want to recreate it for myself and see if it's worth the $20 that they charge for it, which based on all of the ingredients that I bought, I think so. But we'll see how it tastes. And I'm gonna be doing an unboxing of the Rode Skincare, which I got like weeks ago, but I've been waiting to film this video because I didn't wanna do it unless I was doing like a first impressions live. You guys can see like exactly what my reaction is because I'm like super into skincare. I think that I trust her. So I just wanna make sure that my gut feeling is like accurate. Make the smoothie. We are going to dabble into the skincare. You guys will get my first impressions and yeah, maybe we'll be doing some other fun things. So let's get right into it. I have all the ingredients. I have the exact almond milk, the exact hyaluronic acid. I don't have Harry's berry, berries, but I do have organic whole strawberries, avocado, dates, maple syrup, vital proteins, collagen. I have the vegan one, Primal Kitchen, uh, vanilla stevia, sea moss, not air ones, um, coconut cream, and I don't have the strawberry glaze, but we'll see if it's still gonna work out without that. I don't have like the exact, oh, exactly how much each ingredient is supposed to go in it. I'm just gonna wing it and we're gonna hope for the best. And that's just what we're gonna do. Dates. Three should be fine. One scoop. Okay, now the Neo Cell. Okay, we're about to so This is the exact one that they use. It's very flavored. Some maple syrup. This is the keto one, but with the sugar free one. Obviously not Rio's, but you have to like make your own sea moss, basically. So that's what I had to do. We're gonna go in with an organic avocado. Here it is. Ooh, oh my God. This is actually fantastic. Oh my God. Okay, this is worth it. They weren't schooling us. My camera's literally gonna die in like a second, but like, 
This was so much to prepare to like make this, but it tastes so good and it is so pretty even without the strawberry glaze, right? You think so too, right? Make me feel better, say yes. <laughs> but this is so good. And you know what's so healthy for you? Like these ingredients are not easy to get. I had to get a lot of stuff off Amazon or go to Whole Foods. And I also don't understand how to work coconut cream, but it's so delicious. I thought it was gonna be too sweet, not at all. So I haven't even opened it yet. It's still perfectly packed. So let's open it up and check out the goods. Okay, so I'll let you guys get the first. That was so graceful. And here it is. Nicely folded. So this is how it comes. As you can see, I got the full set. This is the Barrier Restore Cream. Let's open it up. Okay, so this is actually a little bit smaller than I expected it to be, but I guess they had to to keep it at the price point because this is the peptide glazing fluid. Oh, it's so itty bitty. I kind of like that it's itty bitty though. So these being this size, really easy to travel with. 1.7 ounces and 1.7 ounces. So you get the same amount in both of them, which I actually really like. That makes a lot of sense. And I do love that I can just put these in my carry-on, but it's fantastic. Lip peptide. So this one is in the flavor watermelon, I think. Yep, watermelon slice. I'm gonna start by testing these out first before I get into like the other products because very decent size. Ooh, it smells super refreshing. I don't usually like things of this flavor because I hate artificial flavoring. Ooh, this feels nice. It's very thick without being sticky. It doesn't taste super artificial and it looks really great on. And it's actually really delicious. I really, really like it. It's gonna be super interesting. I also usually like these kinds of flavors because I hate things that are so sweet and artificial. This is the salted caramel, but this one's Hailey Bieber's favorite hear any sort of noise in the background. I just have a load of laundry going. All right, salt and caramel. Ooh. So now this, just so that you guys can see it. Oh, I got it on the lens. Get this shot without. Flavoring is so understated and it really does taste super natural. It's not so overpowering, it's not super artificial. I'm really pleasantly su surprised by like the flavoring because everything as you know is fragrance free, which is super important. If you have watched Hailey Bieber's YouTube channel, she does the Who's In My Bathroom series and she had Hiram come in and Hiram looked at her Inky list, which is her list of all the ingredients that she has in her products. And he completely approved all of the ingredients and everything. And since these obviously have to have fragrance in it because they're flavored, place to put fragrance on a product would probably be a lip product because our lips are exposed to so much bacteria and stuff anyway. So if we're gonna put fragrance in a product, it would be a lip product since we have more of a, I guess, a tolerance on it. I'm not 
sure I'm not well versed on that at all, but I do trust Hiram and I do trust Haley Bieber because I do think that this is something that she's passionate about and I think that she's doing an excellent job. Like I did not go out of my way to buy Kim Kardashian skincare as pretty as the packaging is, but I did make sure that I, at like eight o'clock on the dot, I bought Haley Bieber's. I just think that she has a lot of credibility. She's not trying to dabble in every single aspect of the beauty industry. She's not trying to exploit it. She's not trying to make money off of it. She chose what she's interested in and that she's passionate about and she's going for it, which is something that I really respect. But she's also super young, so we'll see what else that she dabbles in. But I just feel like Kim K's just, I'm a huge Kim K fan, but I do just feel like she um, is trying to dominate every industry. I love these. These are definitely coming on vacation with me. They, it just feels so nice on. It really is. Now I understand why everyone's posting about it. I love the sheen. It's not sticky at all. It's good quality because I feel like it is thick. I can tell it's doing something. I love the way it looks. I don't know if it's picking up on the camera, but I do love the way that it looks. Okay, so what I'm gonna be doing right now is I'm going to quickly cleanse my face so that I have a bare face when I put these products on them. One second, and I'm gonna wash my face. Okay, so now that my face is completely cleansed, I am just gonna spray this toner that Haley Bieber recommended it. It's from Tower 28. I'm going to go in with glaze. All right, so if we take All right. All right, so it definitely gives you some dew. It really feels light and watery but it does come out, oh, super fast absorbing. Okay, it's like already in my skin. I don't have any sort of residual product. So the glow is still there, but it, my skin really soaked up the product a lot. It doesn't feel sticky now that it's dried, but I kind of expected it to be, I guess, like an oil lay on my skin for a little bit more, but no, it just completely, the shine is still there, the glow, but it's completely soaked up into my skin. Interesting. The Barrier Restore Cream. This is very thick. All right. Okay, it feels really nice. It definitely felt pretty thick when you put it in, but it feels super light on the face. So that's really, really interesting how it has a thick consistency. But once you place it on, it's super light. This is taking a little bit longer to seep into my skin. It didn't um, completely seep in as much as the glaze did. So I'm gonna leave these on my face for like a little bit and let's see how it feels. It feels pretty good right now. This feels a little bit sticky right now, but it's probably just seeping into my skin. Overall, I'm a huge fan. Obviously I have to be using these for a little bit to be able to say exactly what I think about it if I see any improvement in my face but I'm gonna try and make sure that I use these pretty consistently so that I can give an accurate representation on what I think because skincare is something that I'm so obsessed with. Oh, and I really care about not aging. <laughs> We're aging gracefully. <laughs> Definitely bring it on vacation with me. And so make sure that you're subscribed so that you see where it is that I'm going and if my skin has improved using these, because I'll use them every single day until then, and I'm going away in a couple weeks. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my Hailey Bieber video, recreating the Erwan Strawberry Glaze Smoothie and trying out Road Skin Care. We'll keep you updated. Make sure you're subscribed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.